Hey, what's up you guys? It's Bam. So how's your day going? That's good. And if your day is going bad, I hope it gets better. So today we're doing... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Some fruit and eggs. Yeah. And I have a little bit of salsa to eat with my eggs because that's how I like to eat my eggs. But let's just get started. This is going to be a QA. and a that I was supposed to film months ago and it failed so yeah I'm refilming it now this is one of my favorite fruits cantaloupe I just cut it up about 10 minutes ago because my uncle gave it to us Cantaloupe is bomb. If you don't love cantaloupe, you're crazy. And I got some water. This is my brother's thing. And I saw it and it made me think of him, so I'm like, I guess I'll use it. He uses thing about every day. Probably every day. I don't know what my favorite fruit would be. Because cantaloupe's like one up there. Sorry my forehead looks so shiny. It's because the I'm using a lamp. If y'all like this spot better than the other one, let me know. I enjoy this spot a lot. It's just way more comfortable to film in and stuff, you know. Anyway, let's get on with the QA. Now some of these are questions are abbreviated. And I would know. And now I have no clue, but I'm just going to wing it. <laughs> so the first question is, what do I do for fun? What I do for fun is YouTube. Well, one of the things. I'm not just going to say YouTube. I started YouTube. If you've watched me for a long time, you know why. But if you randomly clicked on this video, and you were like, why the hell is this all my recommended like most people well I do YouTube because I was inspired by Shane Dawson so yeah I hang out with my friend Austin he's my best friend since I was 10 I love that dude his mother is like a mother to me she treats me like her daughter his nephews and nieces love me like I'm their aunt I am I have nieces and nephews of my own, which are the love of my life. Leland, which is the oldest, and I'm, I, I'm so bad with like um, ages. And my sister's gonna like be like, you don't know your nephew's age, cause she did that when I didn't know her age. I'm pretty sure I said she was 25 and she was 26, but whatever. I'm pretty sure he's seven. Pretty dang sure, seven or eight. I'm pretty sure it's seven though. Then you have my little niece, N Nayla, Layla. She's literally. I know you're not. I know. People are like I don't have a favorite. Literally, she's my favorite. I'm sorry, Layla. I still love you. Actually, I have a picture of him right here. That's my nephew. He has autism. I'm just getting into a full life story, but she is a year old. I'm a, like she'll be. She was a year old, June seventh. Oops, dropped a piece of my cantaloupe. Shows you how much I. That's another thing I want to talk about, but I don't know if I'll do it in this video. Um, and yeah, hang out with my sister. Love my sister. I am. That's what I do for fun. If you want to know how I made this egg, which if you're a cook, you'll probably be like, you're so dumb. I'm really lazy when it comes to cooking. So I put this, put two eggs in a bowl, threw some pepper on it, and microwaved it for a minute and a half. And it tastes good. 
So if you hate me, hate me. If you're like, that sounds amazing, then do it. <laughs> But anyway, next question is, do I get anxiety every day? And the answer is yes. Ew, every time I do that, I feel like the girl, I can't remember her name, it's like something, but she gets really close to the camera, she goes, I don't know, I love her though, literally, favorite mukbanger. But, she takes her comments off, so I can't comment to her. Anyway, I'm going the opposite of what I should be talking about. Do I get anxiety every day? Yes. What do I get anxiety about? It can be the littlest things, really. If I'm reading YouTube comments, I could get anxiety from just like the comments, like the bad ones, I guess. Don't really talk about that much because. If I let it get to me, then it's gonna, you know. But, when I get anxiety, I get a lot of chest pains. And, I can't breathe really good. And that's when I'm having a panic attack. Um, yes, I have anxiety and panic attack, like, every day when I get in the, sh when I get in the shower. Because it frightens me. Like, legit scaredness. Going through my head. Because I just... If I watch a scary movie and somebody gets murdered in the shower, it just makes me so paranoid. And the slightest little noise will make me think somebody's breaking into the house. I could not take a shower when I'm home alone. Like, literally it's bad. So yes, I do get anxiety every day. And my sister's the best person in the world that texts me when I get anxiety especially when I'm home alone but yesterday I didn't even know I was home alone for the whole day until 12 a.m. when I heard banging on the door I was like it's like that gave me a panic attack in itself if it's midnight are you gonna go answer a freaking door when you think your parents are home hell to the no so I waited like five knocks and I was like Okay, I can do this. I can do this. I, I, I got this. So, went down there. Saw my freaking dad standing at the door. They went to a casino. I was like, I thought y'all were home. And they were like, no, we've been gone all day. I was like, that's why I didn't have dinner. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, yeah. I was like, like, terrified. Anyway, next question. If I was handed a million dollars... What's the first thing I would do with it? Oopsie. You guys fell. Um, first thing I would do with a million dollars is probably fix give me a freaking camera. Uh -huh. I'm just kidding. Um Okay. So be a douche like that. Anyway, yeah, I'd probably get a camera and, like, give back to all the family members that have, like, gave me money throughout the years. So, probably that. Especially my grandma on my stepmom's side because she's literally the loveliest lady ever. Um, son of a biscuit eater. I feel like I was talking... With my dad about this. I can't remember who it was. But. It was something about. Oops. Just touched the hairy cantaloupe. It was something. I can't remember. Like filming a video. I'd be like. Yes. Like I can't remember. But. Yeah. I don't know where I was going with that. My sister. My sister wanted to film a video. I was like. Oh my god. Never thought she'd actually want to film. But I actually would be down to film with her. Ah. Scraping on the fork. Not used to these plates. Try to use paper plates. Woo. Um, would I portray, betray, portray? Would I betray, betray my best friend for five million dollars? Me and Austin's already talked about this question, and we would say, we said that we would betray, betray each other, and then we'd get ten thousand dollars. And heck yeah. But if I couldn't do that, 
Like, if that was on a rule, then no, I wouldn't betray my best friend. Well, it depends on if I could pick my best friend. <laughs> I wouldn't betray Austin. But if it's, like, a friend that I'm not, like, super duper close to, I would. Because 5 million is a lot. And then I'd, like, tell them, sorry, I need $5 million. Here's a million. <laughs> um, if I, if I was given the choice to switch genders, would I? For a day, yes. Because I think it would be cool to see what it would be like to have a dick. But forever, still maybe yes. Because I hate periods like a mother trucker. So, maybe. For that simple fact that I hate periods. If I could visit one place in the world, where would I visit? Two places I want to go is Canada, a Canadian, a, and Los Angeles. Why Canada? Because Ryan lives there. Best friend, seven years, and um, it's a long distance friendship, so. I would love to meet him before I die. <laughs> and then why Los Angeles? Just because that's where like all the freaking YouTube stuff goes down. Well, most of it. Um, you know, it'd be bomb to like run into a freaking YouTuber here. I'd run into freaking people I know because I know everybody in this town. I lost where I was at. Um, if I was going on The Voice, um, what would my song audition be? Like, what song would I pick? That's a hard choice because I think I sing bad in every song that I sing. But I'd probably have to say. The Pressure by Justin Gabriel. Or like, I don't know if they covered it or if it's the real song, but that song. Just the song. It's so amazing. If we don't feel the pressure, we're kidding ourselves. Cause ain't it just like a heart to want something else. I can't sing it good. But if I had to do it, that'd be the song, probably. That is all the questions. So now I'm just going to talk to you guys while I finish my breakfast. So, I've had this thing on my mind for the past couple days, and it's been driving me insane. Me and Ryan always say the saying together, and it's not like our thing. It's just, he's the only one I really say it to, or the one that would remember it, because he's the one who got me into saying it. And it's a word, and it says, that's blank and a half. Like, I can't remember what that blank is, and literally, every time that I've called him, he's been busy, and every time he's called me, it's been, I've been busy. So I haven't been able to figure out. So I'm going a little insane in the membrane. So, you know, I would wish he was awake. Um, I'm going to throw in a, another question. A lot of people, well, this is a question that actually people ask me. They ask me what my, like, some songs on my playlist are. And they were like, can you, like, share your, us with, share, blah, blah, can't talk. Share your playlist with us. And I was like, sure. So, I don't listen to all these songs on here. I just haven't updated my playlist in a minute. So, I'm just going to say my playlist out loud. So my playlist, first song is Candy Paint by Post Malone off the <clears throat> album Beer Bongs and Bentleys. Great, good playlist. Good ass playlist. That is a good song. I don't listen to it as much, but it was. it's on my playlist. This is a playlist I listen to like every day, shower, car, every time. Next song, favorite band, Panic at the Disco. And it's Say Amen 
And in parentheses, it's Saturday night. Oh, it's a Saturday night. I pray for the wicked of the weekend. Mama, can I get another amen? Such a good song. Uh, next song is Psycho by Post Malone and Ty Dolla Sign. Featuring, whatever. Great song. Damn, I hate to go on psycho and I want to be like Michael. Next song. I have a lot of Post Malone. I just realized that. Uh, my friend Gage got me into listening to Post Malone, but. Next one is Paranoid. Really like the beat of that one. Excuse me. Next song is classic. Freaky Friday, Lil Diggy, and Chris Brown. I woke up in Chris Brown Friday. Somehow this shit turned into Freaky Friday. Such a good song. Next one is Yours by Russell Dickerson. I don't listen to that one much, but it's such a good song. Next one is This is America. This is America. Don't get this with that Hey. Next one is Power Glide. Um, a viewer got me listening to that, which is um, Nick. Which is thing, his like thing is Hey, Hey, Hey. You might see him in the comments or you might see him on the live stream. Who's a good, good person? Next is The Pressure, which I said would be my um, voice audition song. So, yeah. I like that one. Justin Gabriel, Under the Covers. Really good song. Next one is by XXX Tentacion. And it's Look At Me. I really enjoyed that song. Next one's by him, too. It's Sad. And that's probably my favorite song at the moment. It's sad. So, yeah. Jacko Bray, or Jacko just made a video. That's nice. Um, the next one is mine. The one that goes, uh... You're so fucking precious when you smile. Hey. Hit it from the back and drive you wild. Yeah, that one. It's really good. Next one is by Kid the Rich. Or Rich the Kid. Kid the Rich. Rich the Kid. And it's Plug Walk. Hey, Plug Walk. I don't even understand. I love my plug stop. Ooh. And last but not least, and I don't listen to this one that much, but it's still on there. And it's Better Now by Post Malone. You probably think that you are better now. Better now. That's off of Beer Bongs and Bentleys too. That's a good ass playlist if I had to say so myself. I really enjoyed this video, guys, for some reason. It's like put a pep in my step. I don't know if I'll upload this one right away. Probably will, though. I really want to live stream for some reason right now. Talk to you guys. I don't know how many people will talk to me at this hour, but... Really enjoyed this freaking cantaloupe, dude. Mmm. Classic. I forget how much I like fruits until I start eating them again. I need to eat more fruits, bro. Mmm. Breakfast of Champions. Wish there was more. <laughs> but I am done. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm just gonna leave the plate there. It's a little empty without it. <sighs> Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, give the video a thumbs up. Smash that thumbs up button. Um, turn on the post notification. Or turn on your post notification. So you get, uh, put no, but, but, ee, so you get notified every time I make a new video. Subscribe, please, please, please. We're almost to 4 million, or 4 million, I wish. We're almost to 4,000. Um, thank you guys so much for um, subscribing and loving me and supporting me. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day or night.
Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day or night. And I'll catch you back here whenever.